Natalia the rescue penguin is finally healthy enough to go back to the wild. There's just one problem. Natalia is afraid of water. Her rescuers have never seen anything like it. Wild penguins spend more than half their life in water. But Natalia doesn't even want to get her feet wet. Poor little penguin. Natalia was rescued only a few weeks ago. Some people found her all alone on the beach, and she seemed really sick. So the rescuers took her back to their rescue center to help her grow and feel better. They gave her a checkup, then took her to their pool to feed her. They figured she'd be the most comfortable there. But she was not. Natalia was so scared, she was shaking. She didn't want to be anywhere near the water. The rescuers weren't sure what to do. They couldn't take her home if she was too scared to swim. They needed a plan to help Natalia love swimming again. So they decided to start small, very small, the smallest pool they could find. But even that seemed scary. She needed some encouragement from her rescuers. And then, once she was in the water, they fed her. That way, when she thought of water, she'd think of food. Wait, Natalia, come back! Okay, let's try again. Natalia was still so nervous, but she was really hungry too. So she gave it a try with a little more help from her rescuers. Nice job, Natalia. After hand feeding her for a few days, the rescuers put the food in the water so she'd have to dunk her head to get it. Natalia looked around and... Yes! You're doing great, Natalia! Natalia had made so much progress. She was starting to love her little pool. But now it was time to try the big pool again, the one most like the ocean. She peeked over the edge and... Nope, 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 no way, not doing it. The rescuers didn't know how they were going to convince her. The water was just too deep. They would need some help. And it just so happened that another little penguin was in need of a rescue. Rosita! Just like Natalia, Rosita was rescued from the beach without a family. But unlike Natalia, Rosita loved the water. Now the big question was, could Rosita help Natalia love the ocean? The rescuers introduced them, and Natalia rushed in to say hello. Finally, a penguin friend. The rescuers led Natalia and Rosita to the room with the big pool, a room Natalia did not want to go in. But the second Rosita saw the water, splash! Natalia couldn't believe it. Maybe the water wasn't so scary? She mustered up all her courage and jumped, ah! But then she was like, hey, this is kinda amazing. Finally, Natalia understood. The water wasn't scary. Water was where a penguin was meant to be. Her rescuers were so relieved. Natalia was over her fears which meant she and Rosita were finally ready to go home. They took Natalia and Rosita on a boat to an island full of penguins and got them ready. Natalia and Rosita said their goodbyes to the rescuers, and in Rosita went. But all of a sudden, Natalia was nervous again. Maybe she didn't want to go. She'd forgotten how to be brave. She needed her rescuers' help one more time. And with a gentle push, Natalia was home. She was like, oh, right, water. I love that. Natalia is a wild penguin again, happy and free in the ocean. All thanks to her patient rescuers who never gave up on her. And to Rosita, the best friend any penguin could ask for. Help the kittens find the subscribe button.